Good morning, everybody. Uh, <clears throat> today, I just want to clear out something, and I don't usually do things like this, but I think it's high time to do this. For people who who think that dragging others is what is going to make them blow on social media, good for you, but with me, I don't think it's going to work again. I don't think it's going to work again because um, I think on this social media space, even before I lost my page, I've always said I don't like negative energy. But imagine somebody took her time to talk about me. I don't know her. I've never spoken with her. She's not my friend. I don't even follow her. I'm not certain that she was following me as well. And can you imagine that these are the side of people who went against my page, who brought down my page? And uh, let me call attention to this lady. I don't know you from anywhere. You had to bring, you fought my page. I'm not asking you, I'm telling you with facts that you fought my page, page because you thought I was trolling your so-called colleague. I hate to come out because when I want to talk to people, I can easily lose respect. Let us watch this video first. Let's watch this video first before I explain myself. I dropped then. You said I dropped you something on the, in the comment section. And if you are and if you are a friend of his, you will make you will mark the page because he once posted it on his timeline saying that he worked with the page. Uh, the name of the page is Big Benji. I want to make us understand something. Big Benji design. He is a brand on his own. Big Benji design is somebody is working on his own. I'm working on my own. B Tech 4 is not Big Benji. Big Benji is not B Tech 4. We associate, we share deals together because we work together in the tech team. And we are not united. We are not like, not like when I say united, it means like we are not working on the same platforms. He, he has his own platform he's managing. B Tech 4 has his own platform he is managing. And that is how we succeed. Now, when I have a deal, I will share this deal into two. I give Big Benji. And I have mine. When Big Benji has his, he shared the deal and he gives mine. But I don't see how come somebody will say, I posted Big Benji. And because I posted Big Benji, I've been walking behind Big Benji's post or Big Benji's page to patrol some, to troll somebody online. I don't do that. I don't troll people online. That's the truth. That's the truth. Because I posted Big Benji is as a means to support a brother. I'm supporting supporting so since when has support become uh, a crime that i supported big benji and then big benji went ahead and posted something and then or commented something under a post of your colleague you came now and attacked me take for them be take for is the one behind big benji did you see him be take for what is your evidence that be take for is the one uh under big benji design now a few days back I'll bring this to your mind. A few days back, Big Benji Design Community was was unpublished. Big Benji Design Community was unpublished, and now this is bringing my mind to why Big Benji Design Community was unpublished because I the set of persons behind it, uh, reporting it and thinking that this is Big Tech Four. Now I want you to go to Facebook and check through. If you see any page or any account that has the name B Rudolph come back here and lay claims on me why do i say this my account was reported b rudolph ever since then there is no day i create a b rudolph on facebook instagram and Instagram. if i create it on facebook automatically the flags it i create it through vpn uh connecting from usa the flag it anywhere i create b rudolph they flag it. They say that it is because it is connected to another entity or is connected to another account that had violated Facebook rules. So they begin to bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. Now I had to go create a different one. Now I think that the people that were behind this particular account, this Mbitech, this Miru that they were they, 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 they were promoting this uh this report, 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 report cases. 
I think that these people, they are the same people that reported Big Benji Design Community because they thought I was the owner of Big, G Big Benji Design Community. And now the people came and opened up themselves and then reported themselves. How is Mbiteko affiliated to Big Benji Design? That you go reporting Big Benji Design and you claim to be Mbiteko. You have not stated it that you reported Big Benji Design. But because Big Benji Design was trolling you online, as you claim, you now come and then tell me that I am the one behind it. And Big Benji Design community was unpublished. And till now he doesn't have his page. Facebook is denying to give him. Mbitek 4 has been unpublished, Mbitek 4 has been deleted, Mbitek 4 has been flagged, he has been done. All kind of uh, violation restrictions has come to Mbitek 4. But still now Mbitek 4 is clean. He can never go down. You have heard the explanation from my brother there. And I let me reiterate on the same thing that this woman said. BTEC has never been a manager to my page because I, I am managing other people's page. Why should he manage my page? I am in the tech. I am an IT personnel, personality and same as BTEC. I came to know we have known each other on social media. We relate like people who have known each other for many, many years. But it's not the case. Why? Because I've understood him. He understands me. We know our boundaries. We do what what is necessary. He does what he does his thing. I do my thing. I'm a brand on my own. Big Benji did not start today. Let me tell you people how the first ever time I faced challenges on Facebook till today I'm facing. In 2022, if not mistaken, I advertised um, a business on my platform. Almost everybody in Cameroon uh, heard about it. My first page, which was, which was 10,000 then, let me tell you, let me tell you my challenges that I faced on the social media, yet I'm still standing. My first page was 10,000 followers. I'm not using the page again. It has not been brought down. That is the page they struggled to bring down. They did not. Because they, they some people claim that it was my platform um, that I advertised and which I had never in any situation said I am the owner of that platform. I have never dis disappeared from the social media space because the Bible says a clear conscience fears no accusation. And because of that, re for that reason, I have never feared anybody. Let me tell you something that you don't know. People went spiritual. People went legally. People came physically. But I wasn't, I was never shaken. The one thing most of you don't know about me is that I'm a preacher of the gospel. And what I do, in as much as I want to do anything I make sure that I'm not doing to hurt anybody. I might hurt somebody ignorantly or uncautiously. The reason why I advertised that platform was because when I was when I joined the platform, I think November 2021. Yes. The person and I was very active, you know. I didn't I didn't know. That is when I said anything online business, if it is not a skill, I'm not into it. People tried to kill me. It did not work because I was I was not guilty. If I was guilty, I wouldn't be living today. They attacked my YouTube channel. They attacked my Facebook channel, my Facebook page. I lost engagement, everything. And now, after a long while, somebody rises again and start again against me. Number one, when they attacked my YouTube channel, they it did not come down. They gave a lot of strikes. You know, the attacks on my Facebook I did a lot that I lost engagement to. So I decided to create a new page which vividly grew up to 15,000 that has been fought again by some uh, unscrupulous individuals. Now, I am shocked to see somebody go and cut screenshot you know look at this screenshot you would see that the upper part of it was not 
posted. The video was not posted. The person who did this was not mentioned. So literally, it's just a dirty scheme against my person and against the person of BTEC. BTEC, I consider him. This is how I've saved his number on my phone, you can see. That is how I see him. I see him as a brother. Why will somebody get up and because you think BTEC is doing something? The question now is, what was BTEC, what was I doing? They said, I'm trolling somebody. If you are my follower from my for, for more than a year, you will know. I've always said, please keep positive energy. Don't follow those who drag people. This is my advice because it, even the dragging at the point in time, you will notice that has destroyed your page. I don't do that. I'm an IT person. I, I, I give knowledge here. A lot of people started also attacking me. This, I was very shocked when I heard even BTEC saying that people attacked him because he's giving knowledge for free. Truth. People attacked me a couple of times because I was giving out knowledge. What they used to take money for from people is what I've been giving for free. But imagine that people came together. People who are going behind just to do, just to bring down somebody's page because they think they are doing something to them. Ask me, what did I do to this person? This rubbish that the person posted claims this. Let me tell you people something, and openly now. I have never reported somebody's page. I've never hacked somebody's page. I never intended to. Because I know all those things. I know how to do them perfectly well. But others have done it to me. But this is the last time I'm going to take it. Nobody can take me out of social media space unless I choose to. But let me tell you, from now hence, anybody that dares to fight me. You cannot fight me on social, um, on internet warfare and win. You will never win me. But if I mean today, people that have done evil to me, if I mean today, I can bring down more than 10 pages. I can bring down 20 pages. But how does it profit me? And I think that because I've been so silent, some people think they are very, very, they have that monopoly of bringing down others. I have seen this happen to people. It is not easy to build a 15,000, 16,000 page and it's brought down just like that. I'm still struggling with Facebook. You can see that I have more than 30, uh, about 30 messages with Facebook, writing and reply, writing and reply, writing and reply. Because I am 